Hi everybody, happy Tuesday. Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com with a double header. We got two cases of 2019 Panini Donners Optic Baseball random team break number one with, with a tiered random teams. Basically we just combo them up all because it's only a 15 spot break. So we combo these up as, as, as best as we could to balance it all out. So the expensive teams with lower priced teams, and blah, 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 blah. So big thanks to everyone right here for getting into it. And congrats to Chris, Cody, Twice, and Adam for winning spots in the uh, previous 8x10 breaks. And Nickel Plant, Last Spot, Mojo, and obviously thanks everybody for buying into this. There are those combos right there. Let's randomize each list. 12, come on, ram.org. 12 times, 6 and a 6. 1, 2, 3, 4, Eleven and twelfth and final time. After twelve times, we got Daniel down to Rebecca. All right, we got Nick Jaspi's help today too, so big thanks, to Nick. Six and a six, twelve times for the teams. One, two, three, four, five. Six. Ten. 11 and 12th and final time. Good luck, everybody. We've got the Blue Jays down to the O's after 12 times. So, Daniel Hayes, you have the Blue Jays Diamondbacks combo. There we go. Mark Matz, you got the Braves Tigers combo. Cody with the Mets Rangers with the spot that you won. Nestor, you got the Red Sox Nationals, Rebecca Angels A's, Cody Dodgers Rockies, Ethan Padres Twins, Nick Last Spot Mojo Mariners Reds, Chris Freeze Astros Royals, Adam Hendricks White Sox Brew Crew, Daniel with the Rays Pirates, Travis Yankees Marlins, Indians Cardinals for Trey, Cubs Phillies for Fidel Cairo, and Rebecca O's Giants. Let's order these by team. Alphabetized by that team name right there. All right, any uh, any trades? What was I gonna do? Oh, I was gonna drop a checklist for you guys. They have waving classes. Wave like Kate Middleton. They do. All the Royals have to know how to learn how to wave. And like Rose Parade princesses. Once I get to case two, I'll, I'll tell you. <laughs> Rays, Bucks, Mets, Rangers. Is a trade. Cody, if that does anything for you. We'll give it a few moments. There's a checklist is in the chat if you want to follow along. And we also have the Nick Cam up there. So he'll be... Uh, Ripping open the packs right here, sliding them over onto this screen so we can go through them really quick. We do have the expressed written consent of Major League Baseball. It's written in writing somewhere. The stream's going to get shut down. So, yeah, I had a case right in front of it. Yeah. There you go. <laughs> I don't, you don't know what it is. Hey, you don't know what it is. <laughs> Could be college baseball for all we know. Rays, Bucks. Turn it Buckos on. for Braves Tigers. That also works too. <laughs> Guess we can turn it off. <laughs> Cody yeah. will do that trade. Mets and Rangers for, for Rays and Buckos. Rays and, Bucks. Rays and Pirates. Cody says yes. Daniel, I'm assuming he offered the trade, so I'm assuming he's good with it. So TB plus Pitt equals New York Mets plus Rangers. Confirmed. So Daniel is out of the Rays Pirate spot. Daniel is out of the Rays Pirate spot. There we go. Cody is now out of the Mets Rangers spot. Both parties saying confirming yes, thank you. Daniel, you now have this. We'll put trade, we'll put T there. So I know it's a trade. Cody, right there, and we'll put a 
T next to there, so we know that's from a trade. So for those of you watching at home, we can keep track of who draws first blood. Uh, Chris Freeze also wants to move the Red Sox. I don't think you have the Red Sox. You can't trade that team, Chris. You can trade. Oh, you're, are you asking if the Red Sox are for trade? I don't know if Nestor is here. Nestor, Chris has Astros and Royals if you're listening. We'll give a couple more moments. Now, this break will take a minute or two. Oh, you're with Nestor. I see. So Nestor is saying, you guys work together. Okay. Well, looks like nothing though, you guys. So let's, it's a longer, it's a long break. So let's get a move on. TWC, trade window closed. Let's print, let's rip, good luck. salon that used to be here. Yeah. All right, good luck everybody. No final scores yet. A lot of the game started a couple hours ago, so let's see. Top of the six. We'll give you a quick score update on a Tuesday, July 23rd, 2019. Top of the sixth, National is up 2 nothing on the Rockies. We have the um, Cardinals in the end of the sixth, up 4-3 on the Pirates. The Tribe hanging on to a 1-0 lead in Toronto, bottom of the 7th. At the end of the 4th, Phillies are up 2-1 on the Tigers. Bottom of the 6th, Mets up 3-0 on the Padres in New York. Red Sox and Rays are tied at the bottom of the 6th. Royals and Braves are tied. Top of the, uh, top of the 6th, 1-1. Astros leading the A's 2-0 in the middle of the 4th. Yankees ahead 2-1 in the top of the 3rd. It's not the top of the 3rd, is it? Do I need to refresh this page? Are some of these games over? Maybe it is a top. Yeah, I just thought this game has been on for a while. 2-1. Yankees leading the Twins top of the 3rd. Uh, in the top of the 4th, Marlins have jumped out to a 4-0 lead on the White Sox. And then we've got a couple late games. Orioles are in Arizona. Cubs are in San Francisco. Angels are up here in LA. And the Rangers are in Seattle. Um, why are prices on this going up? People like it. These case prices are going up all around the world. Supply and demand. Yeah, Topps Chrome is going to be pricey, though. That, that is for sure. Uh, there's Daniel Ponce de Leon to 150. Did we do the second Leaf Rookie Retro? No, that wasn't sold out when we started this break. So it looks like that's going to come up after this break and after Elements. Oh, no. Threat detect. 
Threat detector? Only threat is you're about to overheat with monster hits. Monster hits, yeah, that's the only threat. Our computer was trying to tell us there were it detected some threats. All right, so yeah, this optic break happening right now. Uh, elements, random team right after this. That's a We the People, 76. And then I'm assuming Retro comes up after that. And take a note of our new show times in the chat as well. And Kristen Stewart is our first autograph. And we'll do an autograph recap at the end of this video too. 25 out of 50 on that one. That'll be for the Tigers. Tigers. Top, top row. Why am I, oh, it's the Braves Tiger spot. Tried to trade, couldn't trade Mojo for Mark Madsen. There's the official printout right there. <laughs> SKSing, Chris and Tour is pretty good in Twilight. Very versatile. I don't know how many. I mean, he can play a teenage girl in a vampire movie, and he could hit dingers in and the majors. And, and they're in the new Charlie's Angels. Yeah. How versatile is this guy? Directed by Extremely Elizabeth versatile. Banks. Extremely versatile. Actor, I saw, I, I saw professional baseball that. player. I saw a trailer. There's a new Charlie's Angels coming yeah, out with Kristen with Stewart? Kristen Stewart and two other girls I don't know, directed by Elizabeth Banks, starring Elizabeth Banks. Uh-huh. Who's from Hunger Games and stuff. Right. Okay. Does this look good? I've never seen the original. Nor, uh, nor have I. It was an old television show, I think. Oh, okay. From like the 70s. And then they made the movie with, with Cameron Diaz, Cameron et cetera, et cetera. Yeah. Ryan Sandberg, MVP. Out of 25, that goes to the Cubs. Cubs Phillies combo, Fidel Cairo. So Kristen Stewart plays college ball at Tennessee. All right, Play, plays a teenage girl in Twilight. Gets drafted by the Tigers, still, still finds time for baseball. That's pretty incredible. All right, so I'm gonna slide this stack over. Amazing. Vlad. Woo! Whoa. Green Vlad Guerrero Jr. You know what that means. It means I got to top load this, at least this one. Woo! Hot. That's why people are fine. Hot. Two out of five. Vlad Guerrero Jr. Toronto Blue Jays, Blue Jays, Diamondbacks combo, Daniel Hayes, all aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo woo! Damn, strong. And we got Bryce Wilson of the Beach Boys. 003 out of 125. Braves. Goes to Mark Maths and tried to trade, couldn't trade Mojo. Justin Verlander to one ninety nine. Oh, there's a red, white, and blue. Griffin Canning to one fifty. I thought this might have been an autographed hot box, but no, it just seems like just the regular two. Matt Carbon to a red, white, and blue to 150. All right, another box in the books. So we had the Bryce Wilson and the Vlad Guerrero Jr. were the two autographs in that box. Here is the next one. 
Oh, did you, AJ? What did you do? Did you rip it or keep it? There's DeGrom, We the People, to 76. Um, I think it says only veteran yeah. comments don't ship. Yeah. Only veteran. No veteran comments. No vet comments. Everything else does. So this Manny Machado will not ship, but the Scherzer will ship. That's to 125. That's an insert, so that will ship. Justice Sheffield rated rookie will ship. Acuna Jr. will not ship. Tyler O'Neill refractor will ship. Stuff like this will ship. That will ship. Nolan Arenado will not ship. Etc. Etc. And Vlad Guerrero Jr. a second one for Daniel Hayes. It's the same case too. Nice. AJ, you ripped it, and you got a Baez Posey minis and a stained glass Pedro Martinez. Nice. Those stained glasses are pretty cool. There's Dodger reliever Caleb Ferguson going to Cody in my Dodgers. Nice. So that's your two autographs there. Dodgers need Cody. Caleb Ferguson to come back, Cody. You need some bullpen help. There's Aaron Judge. To 199. And next box. Oh, nice. Nice, Logan. Jason got you a Drew Brees jersey. Now we got Josh James, rated rookie autograph for the Astros. That's for Chris Freeze and the Strohs. 125. Autograph hot box, maybe that autograph popped early. Maybe looking like it. Kevin Kramer. Rated rookie autograph for the Pirates. So Cody Passmore draws first blood in the trade with the Kevin Kramer. I don't remember if Wander Franco's in his. Is he? I don't we haven't seen one yet. We've done a photo. Oh, yeah. <laughs> the checklist. There's Clayton Kershaw to uh, 25 for the Dodgers. Maybe Jason. Just been dodging him. Yeah. A lot of lads. A lot of Tatis Juniors, too, but maybe the Wander Franco. They always short print somebody, shorter print somebody. Taylor Ward to 150. Yep, it is an autograph hot box. It's Alice Kirlov, rated prospect autograph for the Twins. That's going to be for Ethan. Padres Twins combo. Yeah. Out of 50. So it should be two more autos in this hot, hot box. And it's another Kevin Newman. This time, Pink Velocity. Kevin Newman and a different, uh, different photo, too. These, for some reason, aren't numbered, but the non-autographs are numbered. It's another one for Cody and the Pirates. And we have Optic Autographs, Brandon Belt, Giants. That'll go to the Orioles-Giants combo for Rebecca. Nine out of 50 on that one. So those are your five autographs in the hot box. Two prism hot boxes, two autograph hot boxes is what we should be expecting. There's Justice Sheffield. See, these are numbered to 199. And the next box. And there's Brad Keller to 199. Oh, this this might be the Prism hot box. Yeah, Corbin Burns to 60. 
for the Brew Crew. Carlos Rodon to 99 for the White Sox. Jose Urena, Diamond Kings insert to 199 for the Marlins. Andrew Heaney to 150 for the Angels. Is he starting tonight? Mitch Hanniger to 125. I have no idea who's starting tonight. Kenta Maeda and somebody. Anthony Rondon to 150. Mm -hmm. Up here. Oh, Harrison Bader to 25. Is this a four game series? Don't know if it's a four-game series. It's Framber Valdez to 199. I, I like when they did it two and two. I That's like the cool. two and two as well. Edwin Encarnacion to 150. Kind of. Yeah. The Giants are keeping Bumgarner? Well, haven't they won like 13 of the last 16? I guess. These, I guess they they can strike for the wild card. There's Trey Turner. And Joe Adele, speaking of the Angels, rated prospect autograph. Big prospect for the Angels. That goes to Rebecca. Interesting. I guess the, I guess the Giants think they could they could make the playoffs and make some noise. Sean Reed Foley to one ninety nine. Sal Perez to ninety nine. Reese McGuire, We the People to seventy six. And MVP signatures, Jose Canseco. A's. That's Angels A's combo. That's for Rebecca again. Four out of 33 for number 33. There's Nick Castellanos. He's probably getting traded, right? 75. Someone's going to want him. Trevor Story to 60. I hear the, the Rockies are... are I saw MLB trade rumors that Rockies would listen to offers for Blackman, Charlie Blackman. There's Granky to 150. Now, I don't think they're actually going to trade him, but they get overwhelmed with an offer. Wilson they're not Ramos. Doing good this year? No, they, their last two weeks have just been awful. Mm -hmm. They're the opposite of the Giants. 17 out of 35, Ty France. They just signed Arenado for like 10 years. Mm -hmm. Reese Hoskins to 60. 32 out of 60 for the Phillies. A's interested in Marcus Stroman. That would be pretty interesting. A's making some noise this year. Austin Riley. Mark Masson. Rated prospect autograph. Tried to trade. Couldn't trade Mojo. Right? I think Mark was trying to trade the Braves a little bit earlier, right? Yeah. Nobody wanted him. Austin Riley. Possible uh, rookie of the year. There's Vlad Guerrero Jr. Why do we never see Arenado autos? That's probably mostly a Nolan Arenado decision. Justice Sheffield to 150. Some guys just say, I don't want to do it. <laughs> or they just price themselves out of being in products. Someone said Kyler Murray got paid $75 an autograph. Really? At their rookie premiere. Seems like a lot. Yeah, it does, but... Ponce de Leon. That makes sense why they do it. Rated rookie uh, autograph. Aaron has rookie autographs, but just not recently. Cardinals. That's the Indians-Cardinals combo for Trey. There you go, Trey. Daniel Ponce de Leon going your way. Clayton Kershaw to 35. Yeah, I think one of the a common misconception we hear is just like, oh, stupid tops, why don't they get Nolan Arenado to get in there? Well, they, they know Nolan Arenado is great. You know, but if they ask him, they're just like, yeah, I want a zillion dollars in autograph. And, or I just, or he just says no. Not much they can do at that point. Right. 
Next one here. I did see that Ramon Laureano got player AL player of the week. Dust off your there he is right here. Dust off your Ramon Laureano autographs. Corbin Martin to 125 for the Astros. And 34 out of 50, Miles Straw. Astros, Royals combo, Chris Freeze. Nice one, Chris. We the People, Michael Chavis to 76. Tuki Toussaint. Carter Keyboom, Noah Syndergaard, We the People, to 75, 76 that is, not 75, that doesn't make sense, and Fernando Tatis Jr., Ethan with the Padres Twins combo. Nice case so far. Still got a ton more to go. All right, next box. So each stack that I'm sliding onto screen will represent a box, folks. Who do I have financial interest in today? A lot of teams. A lot of teams. Got financial interest in St. Louis. They're ahead by one. Financial interest in the Blue Jays. They're only down by one. They can do it. Mets, up three. Rays, down one. Tigers, only down one. Royals, up one. Reds, up four. I'm on the Oakland A's. Uh, up, down two. And I've got big plays on the White Sox, who are down five. That's not good and the Giants, who are warming up right now. Cubs are bad on the road. The Giants are pretty good. Ooh, Jorge Polanco. Just knocked one out. Gregory Polanco? Jorge Polanco. Jorge. Kyle Wright, a 79 out of 99. Bravos, another one for Mark Matheson. Gregory Polanco's cards are hot. Yeah, I was going to say Gregory Polanco. Missed a few years there. Kyle Tucker to 150. Steven Duggar to 125. Giants. Mookie Betts refractor coming back into focus. There he is. Jay Cave for the Twins to 76. And a Braves box, 9 out of 99. Austin Riley rated prospect autograph. Wow, Nelson Crew back to back? Yeah, that was great, excellent signing. Whether twins. twins could twins could add some pitching. Yeah. He's scary. Team. Were they the ones that made the wild card last year? Yeah. Uh, no, that was like two years, two years ago. Poor Joe Mauer. Yeah, poor Joe Mauer. Um, oh, so let's slide these stacks here so Nick can open up the other case. Okay, thank you. All right, there it is. So four boxes here. Nick's going to be opening up the other case on the Nick Cam. 
Now, Grego is hoping that Ramon Laureano can get Rookie of the Year. Who else could do it? I guess according to War, I don't know. No, no one's really running away with it. War-wise, Brandon Lau has 2.5 War. Vogelbach is considered a rookie. Two. Jordan Alvarez 1.7. I don't think Ramon Laureano is on this list, but if he keeps heating up, he might not be qualified. Maybe. And it's still showing that. Or they just paid that. No, he should be qualified. Because He's been playing since the beginning of the season. Except those e check things. Yeah, let me see. Anyhow. Next box. There's Williams Astadio, 20 out of 76. We the People. This might be in parallel, another parallel hot box right here. Lorenzo Cain to 125. Levi Johnson. Yeah, yeah, we were just talking about that, about Nolan Arenado. He just doesn't sign a lot after his rookie year. After 60, out of 60, Chris Davis. Sometimes some players just don't want to just don't want to sign. Yeah. Justin Smoke to 125. Okay. Jose Barrios to 35. Mike Mustakis to 75. Dakota Hudson to 35. We got Miguel Cabrera to 99. Michael Conforto for the Mets to 199. 93 out of 199. Matt Carpenter to, to uh, 199. Enio De Los Santos to 150. Danny Jansen for the Blue Jays to 199. There's Charlie Blackman. Don Rabb saying, if I were Pirates management, I would trade Corey Dickerson, Kevin Kramer for this guy right here. Yeah, I, I feel like he kind of looks like a pirate, right? Big beard. Wild hair. Get him in a pirate uniform. Bryce Wilson to 150. And Rod Carew. Twins MVP autograph. And then that's for the Padres twins combo. Set that right there. These are all the parallels. Put it right there. Blake Snell to 125. Joey Gallo. To 199. Jameson Tyon, speaking of the Pirates, to 150. People like the tier teams. I've heard no complaints about the tiers. Jacob no, Nix to 150. Oh, yeah. How do we, how do you guys feel about this format? Nick's wondering. There's Garrett Hampson to 199. It stops. Um, Where was... All right. Slide this over right here. Braden, you are in the wrong room for Diamond Kings. That's in the other channel. Speaking of, if you read your item description and scroll down a little bit, you'll be able to see what time it starts and uh, what time it starts and uh, whatchamacallit, what channel it's on. It's in the same building. It's just in a different studio. A couple rooms over. <laughs> Not even, just just the, just the Nick Nick plants like my team suck. No, but the, the concept in general. Steven Duggar to one ninety nine. There's a Victor Victor Mesa rated prospect autograph. Nice. 
nice. So that goes to the Marlins. That'll be for the Yankees Marlins combo. Travis Melberg. Mariners are pretty good in this. Kikuchi. Oh yeah, if you get Yusai, Nick McClan. And Griffey. Oh, Griffey's in this. Yeah, that's not so bad. And the Reds have. A lot of the same teams so far. Padres, Twins has been doing well. It's JK. The Blue Jays. Uh, 75. The concept, he, Nickel Plant likes the concept, just still doesn't like his teams. Even if I pulled you a Griffey? Nick likes it, he just doesn't like the randomizer. Gotcha. Well, you get a gold vinyl of any one of those teams, they'll get your money back. And then some. Oh yeah, Justice Sheffield, Ken Griffey Jr., Mitch Hanniger, Omar Vizquel as a Mariner, and Yusai Kikuchi. There's Chris Shaw to 199. And the Reds have Senzel. I think Nick Senzel's on there, right? Forrest Whitley is your rated prospect autograph. Reds have Barry Larkin, Chris Sabo, Dave Concepcion, Joe Morgan, Joey Votto, Nick Senzel, Pete Rose, and Taylor Trammell autographs. Reds have a lot of stuff, too. Rated prospect, Forrest Whitley for the Strohs, Chris Freeze. Griffey Jr., I don't know about his other autographs. He has at least 42 MVP signature number parallels. And then the other base autographs. That's 52. Out of 125, Rowdy Tellez for the Blue Jays. <laughs> Trey's not happy with his team, too. Indians Cardinals aren't bad. I think that was the bottom of the list. Oh, okay. But yeah, I think there's less risk, right? If we comboed up all the teams instead of just a couple teams, if we comboed all the teams, it shortens up the number of spots in a break, right? So it might even fill faster. And so, because you, you could buy two teams, two spots in a 30 spot break and end up with the two cheapest teams in a random team break, right? But you can buy one spot and you know that the combos are just a little more well thought out. So then you know you have at least a team that's a little bit higher end and compared paired with a team that's a little bit lower end. Cedric Mullins to 125. There's Yusai, Yelich, and Brendan Rodgers. So this is new case, right? Yeah. Okay, perfect. EJC, what's up, Joe? How much new product do you think comes out a year? Does Penny and them always try new product? I'm not sure what. Um, I know that Panini does about th almost 30 baseball releases a year. Or no, are there 30 total a year? 30. Probably 30 total a year. I'd 30 for each score. I think Tops I think it's is? different for every, everybody. I think Dep there's about 30. They make an agreement with MLB. Yeah, because I know there's not there's not as many basketball products every year. But I forget if Panini makes thirty themselves or if it's both Tops and Panini can combine to have thirty releases a no, year. No, it's more than that. Okay, so it's got to be. I think Panini releases close to thirty a year, 25, 30 products a year, baseball products, and then Tops themselves will release another twenty five, thirty baseball products a year. There's Dale Murphy. One out of five. Try to trade those Braves. Mark Massengain that tried to trade, couldn't trade Mojo. One out of five Dale Murphy MVP signatures. Nice. Mark. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo woo. Let's 
Caleb Ferguson again. Far fewer basketball products. I think only Panini does basketball, and that's about 15, 20 releases a year. Somewhere around there. There's a Patrick Wisdom, rated rookie autograph for the Cardinals. We get uh, Trey on the board. Zion signed with Jordan. 48 on Zion. I did see Zion signing with Jordan Brand. Oh, right. Hey, why don't you sign up for Derek while you're at it? Yeah, Jacob Nix autograph. That's for the Padres. That's going to be for. We're going to have no autographs this year. Ethan. It'll be prison basketball. David Fletcher. I know, just find a lot of. Yeah. A lot of parallels. David Fletcher for the Angels. That'll be for uh, Rebecca. There's Dennis Santana, Dodgers. That's going to go to Cody, the Dodgers-Rockies combo. That's only four. Oh, the Dale Murphy, right, was the fifth autograph in the hot box. Starting with these stacks right here will be a the second case, the start of the second case. So we're about 40 minutes in, so we're, ma we're actually making pretty good time here. It's Jose Martinez to 199. Once it sells out, so it should be, if it's sold out already, probably about an hour and a half or so. Is it sold out already? But it'll be on this channel. There's Mitch Hanniger to 150. Harrison Bader to 150. And Chris Paddock to 75. Oh, I thought that was going to be an autograph. Yes, yeah, so probably like 8 o'clock Pacific. Jose Barrios to 125. So this is the parallel hot box. This is from the new case. There's Trey Mancini to 75. Mookie Betts to 60. And Dylan Cease is your rated prospect autograph. And that is for the for the Adam Hendricks, who has the White Sox uh, Brewers combo. There's Jose Urena, 35. What is that? That, that's a weird promo, Twins. Did they you can't give, explain it from like did, an yeah, airplane. Yeah, did it's they give thin. you a did, did they give him a plastic bat knob? It's like a flight attendant. There is uh, Zach Granke to 125 and Pete Rose for the Reds. Nick LaPlante with the Mariners Reds combo number three out of five. Wow. Are you not entertained? Nick LaPlante probably still doesn't like his team. There you go, Nick. And all aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo woo! It looks like they have the same avatar. That's cool. Mark and Cleveland cards. Looks like the same avatar. Oh, Matheson and. Yeah. Uh, it kind of does, huh? The Scooter Jeanette. Out of 99. We still have a lot of case to go. We only just started our first, our second case. Framber Valdez to 76. Edwin Encarnacion to 199. John Duplantier to 50 for the Diamondbacks. Corbin Burns to 125. Carlos Rodon to 75. And that's the end of the box. An Argonaut sold out, says Mark Madsen. So this order may not be perfect, but I just want to type it into the schedule just so. Just 
so it's there. So in the chat is the uh, tentative schedule. Actually, clear myself some space here. There's Noah Syndergaard, there's Brandon Crawford to 199. Looks like a parallel hot box. Willie Calhoun to 125. Tyler O'Neill to 199. Ton. Eric Hosmer to 125. Cole Tucker to 76. And Jeff McNeil autograph. Nice. He might win the batting title this year. That's for the Mets, Daniel Hayes, who got the Mets Rangers in a trade. There you go, something for you. That's Fulte to 150. Miguel Andujar to 50. Max Muncy to 150. And Fran Mil Reyes for the Padres. Nice optic autographs for Ethan and the Friars. Here's Luis Ortiz to 150 for the Orioles. Colby Allard, Braves, who just apparently tied it up to 150. Steven Gonsalves, 20 out of 35, Twins. Matt Chapman to 150. James Paxton, We Are the People to 76. JT Real Muto to 150. Ozzy Albius to 199. Braves. Taylor Hearn for the Rangers to 125. Trey Mancini for the Orioles to 199. Giancarlo Stan to 60. Rafael Devers to 99. Nelson Cruz with home run. Just a few moments to go to 60. And there you go. Carter Keyboom to 99. And Michael Kopech, autograph, rated rookie auto for Adam Hendricks and the Shy Sox. There's Wander Franco. Rated prospect gold, one out of ten. Rays with that one. That's for Cody Passmore in the Rays. Their big prospect in Tampa Bay.
And Danny Jansen. Rated rookie autograph for the Blue Jays. That would be for Daniel Hayes. John Duplantier to 150. And looks like that is that Cedric Mullins back there. There are two autographs, and one. Yeah, tons of products coming out next week, EJC. This week, next week, next month. I think from here on out, it's just going to start getting busier and busier with with just new releases. Nolan Arenado to one hundred and fifty. There's Kristen Stewart. We saw him in the first case. Here he is in the second case. Uh, Tigers. That's going to go to Mark Matheson. He's been hitting pretty well as well. Kristen Stewart. Carlos Correa to 199. Vlad Guerrero to 25. When does Product with Zion release? Well, that's the big question. We gotta make sure. Is, I think Panini hasn't confirmed that they have Zion signed yet or under contract. This first card will be in hoops, though, in the base card. It doesn't have any Yeah. I guess his NBA, his collegiate card, will be coming out in August. And for the Rangers, Pudge, Ivan Rodriguez. That was a trade. Daniel Hayes got the Mets and the Rangers in a trade. And that's four out of seven. Couple off a train whistle, but still pretty nice. The Kristen Stewart and the Yvonne Rodriguez. Good case and a half so far. All right, next box. Good luck, everybody. More MVP. And it's Rhino Rhino Sandberg. Didn't we have a Ryan Sandberg earlier? Fidel Cairo. And Garrett Hampson is your pink velocity autograph for the Rockies. That's gonna go to uh, the Dodgers Rockies combo, Cody. Ooh, Eddie Rosario's on my fantasy team. He's got he's up with the bases loaded. Let's do it, Eddie. Jake Bowers to one twenty five. Luis Severino to one fifty. Oh, that looks like a double play. It's terrible. Ramon Laureano to one fifty. Oh man, we get Angels Dodgers because we have prime ticket. Yeah. Nice. That's what I was wondering. I, guess I, was, I, was like thinking, I was thinking like, oh, it sucks that I won't be able to watch Dodgers Giants or Dodgers Angels. This is blacked out. Oh man. Because they have CBS Direct TV has CBS blacked out. What? See, look, I go to Channel Two. At least it is in oh. on the beach. Oh, no, it's they better, 22. They oh, better no. figure it out before oh, March no. Madness. Oh, Oliver Hermas. <laughs> we can't. That's on Telemundo. See, look. 
Oh, CBS. right, right, right. Because there's a battle between yeah, C- like Intercom or something. CBS and let's find that. Like, oh, I want to pay you two billion dollars. No, we want two point <laughs> five billion dollars. Let's find that prime ticket. Fox Sports. Fox Sports West or Prime Ticket, whatever they call it. Fox Sports West. Joe, it's Fox Sports West. What's where? What happened to Prime Ticket? Oh yeah, we get the Angels Live pregame. The best pregame in sports. <laughs> oh, come on. <laughs> Daniel Ponce Leon, if Rex wants us to fight, this might be the moment, Rex. I just can't wait till Clippers basketball. Oh, stop. <laughs> this will not be a, Please don't put a Kawhi, Kawhi, Kawhi mural. mural. No. Brandon Lau for the Rays. Train whistle. Four out of five. That goes to Cody Passmore. I don't know. Without looking up the values, I feel like the trade is kind of even. Without looking at values, I feel like yeah. it's kind of hitting some things. Hitting. A couple train whistles for both trade parties. There you go, Cody. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Whoop whoop. I don't understand this commercial. Why is she throwing her phone? Steven Gonzalez to 150. Miss that cute AT&T girl. Oh yeah, what, what's cute AT&T girl doing? I follow her on Twitter. <laughs> <laughs> You're Don Alvarez. I, I think she, I think she's like in comedy. Like she does like. I've seen it. <laughs> out of 125, you're yeah, on out. Seen her in like a TV show or something before. You're Don Alvarez. That's a nice one too. Great one for the Astros. What was that number two again? Chris Freeze. 99? 125. He's been raking as well. Someone reminded me that he was from the Dodgers. I totally forgot about that. Yeah, I forgot that too. He's kind of come out of nowhere. Kinda. Yeah, well, the Dodgers like, traded like Josh for Josh Field, like yeah, a middle reliever. Terrible. So Did they traded when he was like 16 or something. Yeah. And then I think like um, He's really good. who's our Houston buddy? Like Jacob or something? Me? No, no, no. The other one, uh, Hobbs. Yeah, yeah. And uh, he was just like, he was trying to make, he was like, I was like, man, I, t- I was like, I totally forgot that, uh, you know, yeah, and it's like, I don't think he'd crack the Dodgers at this point. Yeah. And, you know, Dodgers have, his first, they almost have 70 wins, so it's like, his like first autograph was only December last year. In that's Bumble crazy. Bumble. And the Astros were like the 20th price team. All right, next box. We're getting there, folks. There's Ryan Baruki for the Blue Jays. Daniel Hayes for the Bluebirds. 27 out of 50. This might be a hot box. Alex Bregman to 199. An autograph hot box. And auto was early. How much do you think the movie trailer, like, voice guy gets paid? He's movie, in, like, every movie trailer. Movie trailer voice guy? Like, one. in a world where yeah, yeah. that one... Or he does a stupid comedy thing, too. Um, probably a... Million dollars. And a well, I don't know. See, I wonder if he has they, separate contracts with studios or if he's on a per, per, per basis. trailer basis. Yeah. yeah. There's Whit Merrifield to 199 How much you guys think the movie trailer voiceover guy makes? Or what if it's multiple people? They're just really good at impressions. I think I think I really think there's only like two or three in Hollywood. Like Frank Caliendo, who does all like John. Gilles I mean, they could. Stuff. I guess they could just hire him. Yeah. Maybe not an autograph hot box. False alarm. It's just an early auto. And there is Ryan Baruki's teammate, Jeez. Vlad Guerrero Jr. Case That's two has our third one of the night. Nice Vlad Guerrero Jr. going to Daniel Hayes and the Bluebirds. And there's Eugenio Suarez for the Reds to 150. Next box, ladies and gentlemen, almost done. 
see Nick Jaspi working on the last box right now. Jose Ramirez to 125. Love Fox. <laughs> Fox does have a good theme song. And they always have the nice sky cams over football stadiums and baseball. CBS never does that. They never pay. I mean, but just CBS is just so much better quality line, during the NFL the season. The lady on CBS is Come on. not, not as is, good as Aaron Andrews. Aaron Andrews is overrated. Eloy Jimenez is a nice one for Adam Hendricks. From Michelle Tavoy. White Sox. For the ESPN lady, Joe Namath. Susie Colbert? Yeah. <laughs> Remember when Joe Namath kissed Susie Colbert? There's Ryan Baruki. Yeah, like, unwillingly. <laughs> yeah, the... Definitely got me too. I know. If that happened nowadays. Oh yeah, if you have it nowadays. Back, but back in the day, I'm pretty sure. And he wasn't even that old. Back in the day, I'm pretty sure Susie Colbert. Everybody knew that he was a little it's bit. Not like you can blame it on a little bit of a drunk. <laughs> Who's boozed up? Yeah. Like nowadays, you can say, "Oh, he's just a Broadway joke." Oh yeah. Back in the day, though, everyone was like, that's just Joe being Joe. Yeah. Broadway Joe being Joe. <laughs> All right. Thanks, Nick. There's Ahmed Rosario to 125. Nick Jaspi going live at 12 p.m. tomorrow, ladies and gentlemen. So a couple hours earlier than when we usually go on. Jay Cave, rated rookie autograph. Certified football drops tomorrow, ladies and gentlemen. So. so that's why he'll be going on a little bit earlier to help us get a first start. Uh, certified one's already sold out. So, uh, Jay Cave, twins. Ethan with the twins. There's Tuki Toussaint, rated rookie autograph for Mark Matheson and the Braves. Kevin Newman, here's our autograph hot box. Kevin Newman, Pirates. That goes to Cody. Had the Pirates in a trade. That's to 99. And look at this. We've got significant signatures. Bobby Richardson. Is he a Met? No, he's a Yankee. Played for the Yankees from all his entire career, 55 to 66. Eight-time All-Star, three-time World Series champ, a World Series MVP. That goes to the Yankees. Marlin spot, Travis Melberg. I have no recollection of Bobby Richardson, Mr. Mike Sandy. And I listened to a lot of those 50s Yankees games on the wireless. Corbin Martin to 150. And there's Patrick Wisdom, rated rookie autograph for the Cardinals. I think Zion's one more step closer to upper deck now, <laughs> It's possible. Two out of 35 on this one. Redbirds. That goes to Trey with the Indians Cardinals combo. Yeah, Panini's always a little late with their with their checklist on, but hopefully tonight, tomorrow maybe. The Eloy I don't think was numbered. No, it was just a base autograph. Not numbered. A uh, shot heard around the world was Bobby Thompson of the New York Giants. Bobby Richardson. I don't know Bobby Richardson. Corey Kluber to 60.
Cedric Mullins for the Orioles. That's for Rebecca coming into focus right there. There he is. Rated rookie autograph. So we're almost at the end of our doubleheader. Opt honors optic baseball mixer. Mothro saying the fight and fill split a doubleheader against the Bingham Mets double A. Did I get that right? There's Keston Hira to 99. He's been raking. There's Forrest Whitley, autograph, rated a prospect auto for the Strohs, Chris Fries and the Astros. There's Mike Trout, got him on the Angels Network, they're playing my Dodgers tonight. I don't think I put any, I don't have any financial interest on either team. Anthony Rizzo, to 199. Yelich MVP and Garrett Hampson. Two more boxes to go. Nice progress here, thanks to Nick. Almost there, ladies and gentlemen. After these two boxes, we'll go through some orders and we'll go from there. Do I see some green here? Are those train whistles here? Green and green? I don't know. We'll do that box last. Or maybe I'm just psyching myself out. Miles Straw, rated rookie autograph for the Strohs, Chris Freeze. Giancarlo Stanton to 125. Chris Paddock to 199. Austin Riley. 75, another rated prospect auto for Mark Matson and the Braves. 75. Mookie Betts to 75. Taylor Cole is pitching tonight for the Angels. Kenta Maeda on the mound for my Dodgers. We've got Brad Keller autograph for the Royals. That's going to go to the Astros-Royals combo for Chris. At a 35, nice break, Chris. Here's Chris Davis, Chris with a K. We've got John Duplantier to 75 rated prospect autograph for the Diamondbacks. Goes to the Blue Jays Diamondbacks combo, Daniel Hayes. 22 out of 75. Is this another autograph hot box? I think it is. There's Justice Sheffield for the Mariners. And that goes to Nick LaPlante, last spot mojo. His brother Jordan is in the uh, Dodgers organization. Justice Sheffield kind of highly touted as well. There's that green. It is green. It's Jacob deGrom. Four out of five for the Mets. Daniel Hayes with the Mets-Rangers combo. And a train whistle. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo -woo. I feel like a lot of train whistles in this break. This doubleheader. There's Sean Reed Foley for the Bluebirds. Daniel Hayes, Blue Jays Diamondbacks combo out of 125. Should be expecting one more autograph out of this hot box. There's the other green, looks like Bregman. There's Colby Allard, another Brave for Mark Matson and the Bravos, rated rookie autograph, not numbered. And 
And there's Bregman for the Astros. Chris Freeze, three out of five. All aboard. Woo -woo. And there's our five autographs right here. Felix Hernandez to 75 for the Mariners. And that, my friends, is that Christian Yelich at the very end. Boom, a 24 box, a 12 plus 12. Random team double header break of 2019 Donner's Optic Baseball. Thanks, everybody. We have a uh, autograph recap that's going to happen right now. Let's slide that over here. So we'll go from the last box to the first box. Some nice stuff. Austin Meadows's, Newman's, and Bobby Richardson's. Eloy Jimenez, Guerrero Jr., Sandberg. I love those MVP autographs. Those look really sharp. Kopech, Fran Mil Reyes, Jeff McNeil. Forrest, Victor, Victor Mesa rated prospect autograph. Rod Carew, Austin Riley again. Fernando Tatis Jr., Miles Straw, Austin Riley, Conseco MVP. Nice Joe Adele, Brandon Belt, Kirilov, Vlad Guerrero Jr., Ryan Sandberg, and Kristen Stewart to start things off. Here are some of the low numbered, lower numbered cards right here too. The out of five Bregman, the out of five DeGrom, the out of five Brandon Lau. Out of seven, Pudge Rodriguez, that was really cool. Wander Franco at 10. Pete Rose, three out of five MVP autograph. Dale Murphy. Out of five, MVP autograph. And the Vlad Guerrero Jr. out of five. Woo! Woo! Dang. That's nice. And there it is. Very nice break. Thanks, everyone. Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. We'll see you next time for the next one. Bye-bye.